A special Thanksgiving service has been held to commemorate the eighth year coronation anniversary of His Royal Majesty Omono Banedu Ukwa Kolo Kolo, AY II CFR Oba Benin. The service, which was held at Holy Arusa Cathedral, Benin City, attracted prominent sons and daughters of Edo State. Our senior reporter, best orator, has the details. <laughs> There was jubilation as His Royal Majesty Omono Bane Do Kuakpolo Polo Ewai the Second CFR Oba Benin arrived at the Holy Arosa Cathedral venue of the eight year coronation anniversary and birthday Thanksgiving. I was ushered in amidst cheers and incitement. <laughs> The respected king also received a standing ovation as he entered the church with worshippers and journalists eagerly trying to capture the moment with their cameras. The king and his guests were treated to a variety of songs in Benin language as different troops danced forward to pay their homage to the celebrant. <laughs> The ceremony had in attendance the Deputy Governor of Edo State, Right Honorable Kamri Filishwaibu, Senator representing Edo South Senatorial District, Senator Barrister Neda Imasue, Edo State APC Chairman Imperial Jared Tenebi, former member representing Eguan Kuboha Federal Constituency, Honorable John C. Agwaima, former Edo State House of Assembly Speaker, Right Honorable Frank Okie, Enigi, Palace chiefs, among others. Speaking, Edo State Deputy Governor, Right Honorable Cameron Fleishwaibu, said he was excited to celebrate the eight year coronation anniversary with His Royal Majesty Omonobane Do Kwa Polokpolo or Bayawai the Second CFR Oba Benin. He thanked the Oba for ensuring peace and tranquility in Edo State, saying that Obayawai the Second eight year reign has brought a lot of transformations and progress to Edo State. He added that he's proud to always identify with the Benins anytime, anywhere in the world. Comrade Shaibu assured the Oba of Benin that the incoming Governor of Edo State, Senator Mondi Okpewelo, will protect and respect traditional institution. For all of us that have come to celebrate this day and Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving is coming to bring gratitude. May we continue to give Thanksgiving in our lives. And I can see the Oba prayed before election, he prayed and they were fasting. And there was no life lost. The environment was peaceful, quiet, serene. In fact, we in Edo North, the rain that fell from this side, cool our side. There was no rain, there was no sun. We were just having a beautiful, serene environment. Your Majesty, obviously, the ancestors answered your prayer. In a message, the Ohunsa of Oli Arusa Cathedral, Igbino Wodua Debi, said they were gathered together to appreciate and thank God because of Obaye Wai II's eight year coronation anniversary. He said the Obra of Benin has helped reform Edo and has brought peace, progress, and unity to various communities in the state. <laughs> High point of the ceremony was the coronation anniversary and birthday Thanksgiving by His Royal Majesty Obaye Wai II, accompanied by the Edo State Deputy Governor Right Honorable Philip Shaibu and other guests. <laughs> At different intervals, different cultural troops entertained the Oba and his guests. In an interview, Edo State Deputy Governor Right Honorable Kamri Fleshwaibu, APC State Chairman Emperor Jared Senebe, His Royal Highness Loki Obasuwa, 
Izumogun, the Enoge of Ewoba Ewega, and others said they were happy to identify with the Royal Majesty Obayawa II on the occasion of his eight year coronation anniversary Thanksgiving and birthday, and thanked the Oba for his fatherly role and prayed God to continue to grant the Oba the wisdom and strength to continue to pilot the affairs of the Benin Kingdom. We thank the Oba for his leadership, we thank the Oba for his traditional uh, uh, inclusion as far as government governance is concerned. We are here to celebrate the Oba. It's uh, eight, uh, eight years on the throne today. So we are celebrating, we are all happy. He has brought, uh, his reign has brought uh, progress to Edo. It marks the eighth year of his accession to the throne of the forefathers. I wish him a very long life, good health, most prosperity. Well, it's been peaceful, it's been very, very significant. Uh, it, it has brought a lot of um, innovation, blessings to the to the people the kingdom. The only Oba that we are proud of, known all over the world. We appreciate him. He has been able to bring a new source that brought that together. He believes in unity, he believes in love, he believes in peace. And that's what he has always preached. Advocate for. We have come here to pay obeisance to our Oba of Benin and to also thank God, join him to thank the Almighty God for preserving him and preserving our throne and preserving our kingdom. On behalf of the market women in this state, we wish Obaiwai prosperous years. His Royal Majesty, Omono Bane Du Kwakpolo Polo, Obae Y II, was crowned the 40th Oba of the Great Benin Kingdom on October 20th, 2016, a date that coincides with his birthday. Best Orator reporting for BTV News. <laughs>